Style is K, and if you didn't know, then you are a hater. What I got going on today? Let me put on a t-shirt that we gonna have going on first. Today, I am going to be attending the Snapchat event. Um, There's this woman named Des, Des Gray, and she has been inviting me, trying to work with me um, in a lot of situations. So um, today I'm trying to make it happen. I'm just really trying to make it happen. Usually I don't show up to events because I got a lot going on. Y'all know I've been trying to move. It's literally March 1st tomorrow, and I still haven't found a home to move into. So I'm just, I'm really going through it right here. You know what I'm saying? I'm going through it. Uh, I'm even sadder. I dropped my chain and some of my diamonds missing. But I just feel like my chain should be more stronger than for me to have to just drop it one time and diamonds end up missing. But it is what it is, you know. I'ma take that L. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment on the channel. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, let's run it back. What do y'all? It's Kay. And if you didn't know, then you are a hater. Now, if you don't want to be considered a hater, all you gotta do is like, subscribe, and comment on this channel. You feel me? Just like, like. I got a Snapchat event to um, attend today. Me and Ty gonna go to it, and um, I'm finna put on some clothes. I gotta put on some clothes. What am I wearing? Who knows? All I know is I gotta put on some clothes. Now, let's get into this fit check. Swerve, you crazy. I got a lit bitch, she approached me slowly. Uh, said she wanna know me. Uh, she said, I heard about you. Uh, but you gotta show me. Uh, I got a right where I wanna. Uh, when I get a right, she gonna. Uh, bitch, give me your rights on your own. A beast, be like my game on So, y'all, I got this shit on. I ain't gonna say I'm too fly. This like a, this, this really just like a, okay, you, gonna, you going outside type of outfit. It's not it's nothing that I wear to no club or nothing. But it's cool. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's cool. I don't know about y'all, but when I go to the club, I like to wear black and white. It's just like the easiest, simplest thing to do. Now, um, I'm sorry, y'all. I keep on looking at myself. I'm trying to make sure I look all right. Yeah, it's, it's cool. It's gonna slide. Now, what I... Huh, I think it's my hair. Maybe it's my hair. Y'all like this belt? I don't know, y'all. It's like, I want to do an updo, but I got to understand. <laughs> my locks in the back we hacking right. Man, what's wrong with them? I can't wait till they grow long enough so they can fit inside of hairstyles. Hold on. What I'ma do is, yeah, I can just tuck these motherfuckers. It look, it look good. How my kitchen look? Try to catch it on the camera. Anyway, we'll see. We'll see. I'm finna go see how Ty feel about this hairstyle. Okay, so y'all, as I button up my pants, I just want to say I've been seeing this new pizza chicken thing that KFC uh, out here serving to the human beings of the world, and y'all keep tagging me in it. I'm finna go fucking review it. Stop, 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 stop telling me to try shit y'all ain't tried before putting me in this bullshit. Now I got to take one for the fucking team. I'm used to it. What it do y'all, it's Kay, and I'm back with the worst review I done did this year. When I tell y'all I don't know who in the fucking they right and wrong mind with... Let's just get into it. Now, before we get into it, I just want y'all to go follow me on Instagram. It don't take nothing but a goddamn tap. Now, y'all know it's a little different. Y'all don't see me with my nails done. Trust me, I don't like this shit neither. I feel like I got some booty fingers. But it's all right, y'all. Everybody had their days. At least I'm cute. And one more thing before we get into this review. If anybody have a problem with me cussing like a sailor, get your bitch ass off the video. It's just that simple. But anyways, y'all know KFC got this new little piece of chicken, cheese, chicks, whatever the f It's basically a big ass piece of chicken with some pizza toppings on top of it, and they calling it a cheeser. A chisel. A ch uh, I don't give a damn. It's an abomination. That's what the f it is. So my look at me, big no. I done pulled my goddamn happy ass up and goddamn KFC happy as f to try the little shit. I'm talking about smiling harder than a man on the bag. Now, honestly, when it comes down to some weird shit or whatever y'all tag me and tell me y'all want me to try, I go take one for the team. And of course, y'all kept tagging me and I want you to go try this case. So I, I, I pulled up and I went and tried. And to be honest, y'all, it ain't looked that damn bad. It looked, it was all, it, it didn't, it, 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 this how it looked. But I ain't saying it looked good, but I'm saying I done seen uglier food than that. But honestly, y'all, I was like, that shit might go together. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody, every time I order pizza, I order them little chicken wings too. I'm thinking this shit gonna be kind of good. And y'all know I don't like to eat with my grill in. My shit ain't permanent. So I take them the fuck out when it's time to eat. One time I ate some damn with them on, and I'm telling you, my goals was stanky for two weeks. I said, God damn, bitch. and I ain't fucked shot no more neither. Bitch, what the fuck type of shit you got going on? So my goddamn bitch, strong ass coochie juice to stain my goals. Y'all remember that commercial, Dutty Mouth? Clean it up with orbits. Somebody asked me the other day, was, would I ever close my gap? Uh uh, bitch, I, mean, I need something to lie through. I can tell six lies back to back, you wouldn't even notice because it snuck through the gap. Bitch, I love this gap. And y'all, I know it be taking me a long time to get through the goddamn reviews. I don't understand what I be going through in real life because somebody always calling me when I'm trying to do some shit. Come calling me, asking me, can you borrow $4 to tomorrow? Y'all, I ain't having that shit this year. Baby, read my lips. I ain't got it. And if you was going to give me the money back tomorrow, 
bitch wait until tomorrow to do whatever the fuck you is you trying to do. And then go sit up there and hang up in my face. Oh, Deisha, bitch, don't call me no more. Until my bitch, we been friends for two weeks and you already asking for money. Mm -mm. Now, to be honest, y'all, I kind of knew it was going to be some bullshit when I ate one of the pepperonis. The pepperoni tastes strong as hell. I said, God damn, what in the weight lift the fuck is this? Then they go sit up there and place them all down crazy like a fucking baboon. Why would you give me that fat ass piece of... Anyway, so my finger looking good. I was mad as fuck about licking my fingers in this bitch. Then I pick it up and pull it apart, thinking the cheese was gonna pull like it did in the motherfucking commercial. That is false as fuck advertised. Then I had the nerd to sit up there and put that damn thick, ugly ass marinara sauce all across the thing and slap some cheese on top and some pepperoni. KFC. I don't give a Kentucky fried fuck y'all got going on. This ain't gonna work. And to be honest, I been stopping y'all chicken 10 years ago when I was able to buy my own food. Then y'all got that goddamn rough ass chicken, that the gross sister's ass chicken. G get that goddamn chicken out the gym. I took a little bite of the chicken first and I said, goddamn, who the f that punched the hole in the jaw? Y'all ain't lying, that goddamn chicken tastes like a sit up. But you know what, y'all? I still took a chance and I dug right in. I took a big ass bite. If anybody go to KFC and get that chicken pizza and do a review and say it's good, they done got paid. Report them. Ain't no way in motherfucking hell or heaven nobody ate that shit and said, mmm, this is good. That shit stressed me the fuck out. That depression tasting ass chicken. The goddamn chicken already tastes like kneecaps and you got the nerves to throw some motherfucking pepperoni and cheese on top of the kneecap. And when I had pulled up to the restaurant, I, I, I noticed that the workers know me. They fuck with me. So I said, goddamn. If they know who I am, I wonder who the cook was. I must did something to the ass. I'm talking about that shit tastes like an art matter. And I said, who the f don't like me? I don't know what the f would make a mother f do that, but I damn near went to corporate. The only reason I ain't making the corporate because that shit hit my stomach so goddamn hard, y'all. I was shit for two days and I had just ate. And I tried to call corporate, but that shit had me so f up by the throat I couldn't get it out. Thank you for calling KFC. Who in the f that's all I can get out, y'all, before they hung up in my face. I'm trying to warn y'all now, don't eat that shit because I had something hung up in my ass. But not for real, I'll joke aside, y'all can go eat what y'all want to do. If y'all want to go see that it's nasty, I actually would advise you to. Finger licking good my ass, bitch. If I had to lick my fingers, you, if, if I lick my fingers after eating that shit, I might well dig my ass and suck. I was literally appalled at the taste. It was so fucking disgusting. I literally balled it up like a classroom sheet of paper and threw it so far across the parking lot. Y'all, I threw that shit across the parking lot and waited 20 minutes, a bird didn't even eat it. But not for real, even though I don't go to KFC, I can't lie, they got this one little thing on their menu, bitch. You, you, you did that one little thing. Bitch, I'm trying that motherfucking mashed potato bowl. That, mother, that mashed potato bowl. Oh, y'all got that. I'm talking about, bitch, this one little thing. That's that one little thing y'all ate up right there. Y'all, y'all, y'all did that. Y'all see how the cheese pull on that? See, that, that's what y'all fucked up at. I tell you, I ain't giving y'all no more chances. That potato bowl, that's the only thing I'm gonna come with. Anytime I ever even much try to, to attempt to fuck with y'all. Now, before we end this review, just in case y'all didn't hear me the first time, go like and follow my support page on Facebook. If you don't, you don't like to see the shit in your face. Do I know y'all been asking me to drop more vlogs on YouTube, so you know what I'm saying? Just give me a chance to get it the f together and not be ghetto on YouTube, bitch, and I drop some videos on that bitch. I smoke just one little piece of blunt on there and they gonna sit up there and d d delete the goddamn video. And why I got more motherfucking followers on TikTok than any other platform? You know what? I'ma just let it be. I'ma let it ride. Now, y'all know I've been doing a lot of wig giveaways, right? So, at the end of most of my videos, I'ma do one wig giveaway, bitch, because lately I've been doing three on every video. I be got good and got fucked down. And I mean, you gonna have to take your ass to Facebook, bitch. That's why I do my giveaways at, because that's who the f pay the most. Sorry, y'all, if I sound mad. I really am about that goddamn chicken piece. That shit had me so goddamn mad, I slapped the KFC man forward and backwards. I slapped the f*** out that bitch. And I understand KFC been here for a lot of years. I know he probably dead and gone, but I damn sure hope his kids feel it. Somebody be. Okay, y'all, I, I just got back to the house from uh, from KFC. Nasty. <laughs> I got my little pickle going on. Mm-hmm. I'm in love with you. You set me free. I can't do this thing called life without you here with me. Cause I'm dangerously in love with you. I decided to just cut hers up and dangle everything on top of it. I'm sorry. Anyways, y'all. Now, I just left KFC and that shit was so goddamn nasty, y'all. That shit was so goddamn nasty. It don't make no goddamn sense. Ugh. Goddamn KFC. I don't know who the f keep y'all open. You gotta be somebody mailman. Now, um, the Snapchat event was a very good event. It was a real good event. I got that. It was a lot of creators, big and small, looking for the opportunity to collab and shit like that. And I don't usually do videos with folks, but y'all had me in that area, so I went ahead on and did them. Them little public interviews and shit. I hate them hoes, but I went ahead on and did a lot of them. And I'm gonna show y'all the content from the event. Uh, man. Before I end this vlog, I just want to say, uh, hold on, let me cut on this light. I know this vlog not as long as usual, and that's because, y'all, I got so much shit to do. I got to move. I got a lot of shit to do, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm really getting all that together. Now, I found a new house. Let me get some claps for that. 
Thought I heard somebody else clapping in this bitch. I've been watching a little too much First 48. And every time I watch First 48, I feel like the motherfucker died. I got to stop watching that death first four days. I'm trying to tell you, I be thinking that the, I don't even be thinking this the killer in my house. I be thinking this the motherfucker that didn't die. And you know, evil spirits don't go to heaven. I hope I die a happy death. Anyways, y'all, make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment on this channel. You know what I'm saying? If you go try that chick, cheese, chisel, cheese, chisel. If you go try that bullshit that KFC is selling, then let me know. And 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 if you already tried it, then comment below and let me know if you liked it. You a liar. If you say you do, it tastes like the back of five asses. Usually I say stuff tastes like the back of four asses, but that was five asses that it tasted like the back of. That tastes like some shit that somebody put together with they they ass. That tastes like something that something some that some that somebody put together with their ass and a couple of stutters. This sound like that, that tastes like some shit that somebody stuttered as they made because they wasn't too sure upon the idea. Whoever in the fuck decided to put some cheats and some, some pizza on top of some KFC, which already nasty, you are wrong. The only thing anybody should go to KFC for is that goddamn mashed potato bowl, and that is motherfuckers sometimes, because who in the fuck want corn all up and through that goddamn digestive cells? You gonna eat that shit, and I'm telling you now, that corn gonna slap your ass on the back of the neck in the, when you hit that toilet. As soon as I ate that goddamn piece of chicken shit, I came home, and I shit it for two days. And it ain't even been two days yet, I just ate the shit today. That shit was so goddamn nasty that they put the end in it. You put the end in nasty. I don't like that shit. That shit tastes so motherfucking stank and nasty that bitch, why is it already stinking in here? That shit tastes so goddamn nasty. It tastes like a nursery home. That tastes like some shit that somebody eat when they just get teeth. That, that tastes like some shit that somebody eat when they trying to be healthy but don't know what the fuck healthy is. That tastes like some shit that'll make your chest rot. That tastes like some shit that'll make your, your knees ashy. That tastes like some ashy. It tastes like ashy. And I don't even know how ashy tastes. But lick your kneecap and that's what it tastes like. That shit tastes like some shit that make anything musty. That shit tastes like some shit that make anything crusty. That shit tastes like some shit that if you taste that shit, you walk out the door, your shoes brown. Brand new shoes, you pump some brand new shoes, you go eat that shit, you walk out the fucking restaurant, your shoes gonna be brown. That tastes like everything, bro. It tastes like ass. It tastes like doo doo. And I know what ass tastes like because I'm familiar with it. That shit tastes like some shit that if you lick a light bulb and you choke, that, that shit tastes like a choke. This shit tastes like a sneeze. That shit tastes like I chew. That shit tastes like anything that'll make you sick. That shit tastes like motherfucking Ebola swine and all that put together in a motherfucking cough. That shit tastes like uh, uh, some snot inside of a motherfucking napkin. That shit tastes like a goddamn piece of shit from the back of some asses that came from goddamn Bermuda. And I don't even know how Bermuda asses be, but I ain't heard about it. So it tastes like an unfound, unheard of piece of shit. And I ain't, I ain't with that. I will be mad for three more days. I will be mad for a while, okay? Now, for the ones that's wondering, damn, okay, where you at with the content, bitch? I'm trying to move. And I refuse to motherfucking get on my own nerves trying to get do all this goddamn content, bitch. I will be back. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment on this video. And if you don't, fuck it. Don't, don't go to KFC and try that shit. Matter of fact, go to KFC and try it. I don't want them to sue me for deteriorating their motherfucking fans and support them. Fuck that. It was nasty to me. It's gonna be nasty to you too, trust me. Yeah, so these niggas fake they some ass. I'm just acting tall when I dance with the Glock like a pass. I'm step on his ass like some glass. These yeah. niggas know I've been doing this shit on crib. I swear to God it ain't new. Told the bitch after I hit this bitch you gotta do. One other bitch out of.